Let's step up, get in the kitchen, do your, do your thing. Today, our friend Chef Aaron is here from Kroger with some easy recipes for mothers. Are you, are you, let's go, let's do, I can, let's go. Now, you may right. not know this about me. Not the most organized guy in the world, <laughs> okay? But give me something that I can do. But the for energy my... is there. Right, right, E for effort, let's go. <laughs> what are we making, let's chef? Start, let's start down here. So what, I, uh, what I've done here is I've taken the, the Cordon Bleu and put it in a little bit of a Polynesian twist here. Aha! Uh, so we have some uh, Swiss cheese. I'm okay. using the Beamster out of Murray's today. Okay. Uh, some diced ham, so you don't have to cut it yourself. Good and move. Then, uh, Pineapple. Yeah. So you can use crushed pineapple, diced pineapple out of a can. Uh, we have some good pineapples in the store right now. We have one of those deals at home where you can cut off the top and you do like this, you know? You're and ready. It, and it does You're ready the, for this yeah, one. Yeah, I like that. Okay, good. I can so do this. So you can butterfly the chicken or if you have a nice butcher, which if you go to Kroger, we can take care of that for you. Butterfly okay. the chicken. You're going to mix equal parts of the diced ham, the Swiss cheese, and pineapple. Okay. Stuff it inside. Close it. Uh, you don't have to tie this one off. If you want, Stick a toothpick through there, and yeah. you're gonna throw this Parmesan herb panko breadcrumbs on there. Okay. What it's that's just gonna sprinkle. do? Already seasoned for you. Love uh, that. You can roll it in a in a pan in a tray if you want. Okay. Uh, we're gonna do some parsley for garnish. But the kicker here. What do you got? Whoa! What do you got? See that we, was hit. Oh yes. We sell Chick Fil A Polynesian sauce, and this is gonna Love go that. with that pineapple in there. Yeah. You're just gonna take it when it's done. Give it a little bit of drizzle. That looks amazing. That looks so, really, really that's good. That's doable. Right? Okay, that's doable. I can do that. I can do that. Why couldn't I do that? Let's go easier. Even easier. That sounds better. Okay, we have 90 second rice. Looks okay. like you made that from scratch, right? It does. You're going to take some salmon. Uh, this is about seven ounces a piece. You can go whatever size you'd like. Okay. Uh, and we're going to put some wasabi peas into a food processor. So those okay. are going to have a little bit of spice, but it's going to add a little bit of crunch. Mix that with some mayonnaise. Okay. Uh, and then we're going to top that on top of the salmon that's already been seasoned with this mushroom umami herb. Umami. So you see you it's see Mother's how Day. you see how many ingredients we've got here, right? We do. There's not very many. Yeah. That's a win. So you're going to top it, you're going to bake it. You can add some steamed broccoli, something like that. You can cook some some vegetables to go with it. Yep. Uh, but all I've done is I've baked it until it's about feeling firm on the sides. Sure. Uh, and then <laughs> topped it right on top of the rice. When that white starts to come out of the side, the protein starts to come out of the side of the salmon. That's when you're, you're done. You're long done. Okay. You're long done at that okay. point. Okay. That's good. Okay. Good. Now see so now this, this one. This looks the coolest to me. Like I would mm -hmm. like to be able to do this, but I'm very I'm very worried that I can't. Guess what? 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 You're gonna do it. Okay. Like right now? <laughs> yep. That's why I put the gloves on. That's why you put the gloves on. Okay. So I'm what gonna you, I'm gonna lean right here. Okay. I'm okay. Take what do you load up? What, what do you want me to do? Uh, two pieces of bread. Two pieces of bread, just on the board. Right on the board. Bang. So what? Zoom. What this is is it's an everything uh, French bread. All I've right. just cut it about an inch and a half thick, toasted right. it in the pan with some butter. Yep. Easy. Uh, next we have some avocado that's been chopped up with some lemon, salt, and pepper. Just take a handful. Just just glop it just, on there. Just, just take like a handful. A glop. Just put it right on top. Glop. Right on top. Fizz. Oh, what a relief Challenging, it is. Challenging, right? Yep. So far, so good. So next, yep. take your other hand. Yep. Here, let me help you out. Okay. What are you doing? Oh, wow. There you go. Okay, now. Take your other hand. Yep. So this is king crab that's been cooked yep. in our roasted red bell pepper butter. Okay. So king crab is on sale right now for $24.99 a pound. Okay. That's about half price. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. That's, so that's take some of that. Camp. Put it right on top. How, like, how much is too much? Or is there too much? You tell me. It's Mother's Day. It, well, bang. Love you so much, honey. There you go. There you go. My wife. <laughs> and look at, and look look at that. that falling off. You got that. the decoration. Right? Like I did that on purpose to make it look all like artsy. So like, to finish this one off, you can okay. add a little bit of lemon juice to the top. You yeah. can add some parsley to the top. All right. We can give it a little. Man. I like to use parsley, sage, rosemary, and thyme. Oh, I like okay. it. I like it. And That's it would work with this. All right. Uh, but if you need, you can put some... Uh, some mixed greens on the side. You can toss that with a little bit of lemon juice, maybe a little bit of olive oil. But look, you said you couldn't do it. Boom! Look at that. Can we get a little? Can we get a little, little, little shot of that tight, right? So tell me, I got to wrap up. That looks amazing. If I was, they all look great. That would be the one I would love to. That's be, the showstopper, right? That right? is the showstopper, right there. So the there. king crab's already cooked. You just got to use some kitchen shears, cut it out of the shell. Butter's already made for you. Right. Avocado, you're just cutting that out of the uh, out of the shell, taking yeah. the nut out. And a little bit of lemon juice, salt, and pepper. Off we go. Everything is relatively done here, but that's a showstopper. That is the one that gets it done. Hey, as always, appreciate you. We'll get more information at local12.com. This guy is the best.